Hello everyone, welcome back to the video continuation of Access Press Store Pro where in this video I'm going to show you how to configure uh, this section from home page of Access Press Store Pro. As you can see this is a demo site of this theme and this is the particular section I'm going to be showing you how to do this that is a call to action with video section. So to do this let's log into your WordPress then you need to go to appearance and then click on widget you need call to action with the video widget to need, uh, which need to be placed in home main section widget pass just click it and select the area that is home main section widget and add this widget there after this widget is added now you have to do is put a title and put a video type text like what kind of, uh, what kind of video you are going to show there I'm going to be putting YouTube video so I'm going to write YouTube then you can enter a font awesome icon there so to do this go to font uh, awesome widget uh, sorry uh, website where you will find there is icon you need to click there you need to select an icon <coughs> sorry then I'm selecting this YouTube play icon because it's similar as in our demo site as you can see thus I'm gonna be copying this text and pasting it there now you need to write video type button URL you need to put a button URL so just copy the URL uh, of the video from the related website put there now you can put a video title well I have it here this is the dummy title which you can put your own title there after this you can put a small description and then you can upload an image for its background then you need to put a video iframe for this go to your video I'm, I'm getting it from YouTube so go to your YouTube video right click on the video then you will find there is copy embedded code you need to click there after that that code will be copied and you just need to paste it there well you can configure its height and width from here as you can see but I'm gonna keep it like that you can put a button text there and a button URL well, I'm gonna copy this URL and put it there now after you have done all the configurations here you need to click on save now that you can see your configurations are saved for call to action with video so let's go to our front end and see how will that appear this is our front end and as you can see here is the call to action with the video section with title and everything font awesome icon a button a video as I have said you can always uh, change its height and width according to your requirement so in this way you can configure this call to action with video from home main section widget area and putting their call to action with video widget so I hope this video is helpful to you in configuring that section as in our demo site and if you have any confusion always refer to our online documentation there you'll find a picture description of all the steps or you can write to me down below and I'll explain you more so thank you very much take care